hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel and to our let's play i thought um why not start a new day make some progress get the campsite built and then probably move probably travel another day and then get a campsite visitor so um lots of stuff is gonna happen today <laughs> hello there everyone right now i'm callan it's 1 14 p.m on tuesday july 12th 2022 now for today's announcement starting today callan has its very own campsite the campsite is a place for visitors to experience the beauty of our island and the kindness of its residents i can't think of anything more fitting for callan i'm sure we'll get plenty of visitors so take a moment to wander over and spread that island charm and of course we'll be holding a special ceremony to celebrate the happy news if you're interested in participating in half the time please check in with Tom Nook at Resident Services. That's all for now. I hope you have it. I hope you all enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. All right, a very different vibe to start the day, you know, with Isabel compared to Nook. And um, we're going to see, I think everything that happens today is literally that the campsite is built. Like there's nothing else, no, no visitor just yet, nothing. We get some miles oh because we've upgraded our house right a thousand miles awesome we're we're close to um the pocket extension that's what we're gonna we're gonna get last time um of course we're just gonna go of course check our mail that should be the first thing um Oh yeah, the garden lantern we ordered and then Happy Home Academy. To celebrate the new addition to your home, please accept a small gift. You'll need convenient electronic appliances for your upgraded home. Okay, so I guess they want me to have like some type of media room. Sometimes it feels like they want you to make a certain rooms that they, you know, they've added to your house a certain something. It's an automatic washer. Okay, I expected something different from what they said. <laughs> um, and what was this? Oh, cardboard box. We're also going to go place that. Um, but yeah, apparently they want me to make my main room a laundry room. Is, is that is that what that was? I am not really feeling that, I don't think. But, you know, that's okay. Um, okay, so what we're going to do before we actually... I think we're just going to go do a couple of daily things. And then actually just go jump to the next day, right? I think we all want to know who the campsite visitor is. We all kind of want to... That was money rock for the second day in a row. That's impressive. Impressive? No, interesting. It's not a good, it's not impressive, it's just interesting. Also, I think I forgot to get our money uh, tree yesterday, but it's okay. It's totally fine. Um, Isabel didn't say something about a visitor, did she? I caught a Raja Brooks bird wing, nothing else, at Raja be doing, and I think that was new. I think my character just said yes. I thought we already ha had that one. I guess it was the other, um, the different green one that exists. Cool. Okay, we're we're getting uh, some new some new bugs as well, which is cool. I'm still looking for those uh, little ones that spawn on the rocks, but I guess today is not the day. <laughs> um, okay, we're gonna. Are we gonna get all the rocks today? I think so. And then I guess uh, we're gonna see if Nook does have anything to tell us. Probably not. He's probably just gonna congratulate us on our, like our um, on the campsite and maybe our house too. Does he say something about our house still after like once it's just like built out? I think so. I think he kind of is like, "Ooh, it feels roomier, right?" And like, "Ooh, please pay." <laughs> That's pretty much, pretty much accurate, I think. Okay, it's also super sunny again today. <gasps> Butterfly that I think sells for a little bit of money, so we're gonna get it. There we go, Madagascan Sunset Moth. This was the one that we already had, and I, I confused the two. Okay, so, oh, very important. If we, you know, we already forgot yesterday, we are gonna get to it today though. So we're gonna go and get a 10,000 bell um, bag. Briefly forgot the word for that. <laughs> and put that there so that we soon have a money tree. Awesome. Here's a little rock for us to hit. Um, I hear awesome bugs in the background also now that resident services is built um and upgraded pretty much uh we now have the hourly music uh which yeah the starter music is music is, is much better i i wish that 
there was like an option to just put on like any music or it just kind of every once in a while also plays that one i don't know i miss it already <laughs> and it's been like a day <laughs> it's been a day okay one two three wait we've got money rock and then the one in the back on the higher uh cliff tier and then three on this so that i four rocks i we've gotten four rocks right my memory is great also did we go to Oh my god, Cherry, are you okay? Honey. <laughs> wow. <Ooh. laughs> oh my god, they're all working out. What is this? Okay, Cherry, hello. Sup, what, what, where you had it? Headed. This island's got a ton of foods I've never heard of. I'm trying to come up with meals for as many as I can. I feel like you've told us that 700 million times. And all Cherry ever talks about is food, which honestly, I get it, but also... Come on. <laughs> Like, I mean, I talk about food a lot, but like, wow. Afternoon stubble. <clears throat> Afternoon stubble, you doing good? This weather really gets the muscle glistening stubble. Mm-hmm. Hornsby, what do you have to tell us? Hi, how you doing? Callan is the perfect size. Too big to see across, but too small for a sea monster to attack. Yeah, you know, they ask themselves why we don't talk to our villagers every day, but like... The dialogue is so repetitive, I will say that. They, like, a couple of times they added some new dialogue here and there, but really it's not, that's not enough. It's really not enough. Oh my god, why does it have a pink cage? That might, that makes no sense. I don't understand. Okay, um, any, oh, we have a visitor today. Who I kind of don't want to talk to. I don't know, there's very few NPCs that I like. Or, not that I like, but that I still kind of talk to. She's not one of them. Um, plus, like, all her stuff is very expensive, so I, I, I don't know if I'm gonna... I don't think I'm gonna talk to, to her today. Um, okay, rocks. Let's check out the campsite. And see if, like, Nook's Cranny has something special. And then I think, so the campsite is built. Awesome. And then, yeah, I was going to say, Able Sisters should be in the middle of being built. We do have a message bottle right here. I've, I've spotted a couple of, um, a couple of shells, which we're also going to go and collect. And there we go. We've talked to Cherry Coach Wooden Chest. Oh, okay. I thought I knew, I knew that already. Okay, Cherry Coach and Hornsby. Uh, here's a fossil. Molly is home. I see a bug in the background. <laughs> My brain is going 700 miles per hour. Okay. Uh, net. And then we're going to get to this one first before we go inside of houses and it's gone. Okay, perfect. All right. Again, one of those. Mia Mustag. Annabelle isn't home, so we still have to find her because, you know, if we talk to, like, some villagers, we really should talk to all of them so that we, um, were able to, um, we're able to, oh, Molly's crafting. Wow, that took me, why did that take me so long to notice? Uh, so that we're able to get that achievement, right? Sorry, I'm in the middle of something right now. Uh, what are you up to? I'm currently crafting a hyacinth wreath just to see how... I clicked too fast. I don't know the ending to that sentence. <laughs> oh my god, I'm sorry. Uh, DIY is a great way to learn by doing. I'm totally obsessed with it. Want to learn how to make your own hyacinth wreath? Sure. All right, I wrote down all the details right here. It should be easy for you. Okay, that's a pretty good DIY, even um, if we have no uh, no option or no possibility to craft it because there's no hyacinths anywhere, but um, I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so the only one missing is Annabelle. Um, and then let's go talk to... Oh, yeah. No, wait. Nook's Cranny first. I was going to go to Nook's Cranny. And then Nook. Nook's cranny? Nook. Got it. Okay, let's do that. Let's see and hope they have some cute furniture. Hmm. 
Hmm. I was gonna be all disappointed, but then I saw the cactus set. Seems like you're interested in a mini cactus set. Let's see, that's 400 bells. What do you think? I will definitely buy that. That's very cute. Okay, um... I think the rest know. <laughs> I want to do nothing, actually. Uh, never mind. Sorry. Sorry. But let me just quickly check what they have in their cabinet because maybe they've got like an interesting wallpaper. Um, feel like I purchased the one that they had before. Okay, no, we're gonna. How much did they sell the peach for? 400? No, that must be wrong, right? That must be wrong. They can't sell peaches for 400. If they, if they did, that's actually rude. <laughs> That's like, that's like r actually rude. Okay, um, Voltipole will go hop. And even though it's pink and we don't like it, we're gonna wobble the wobbly horse. <gasps> and, okay. Okay, y'all, y'all, okay, wait. I have to be the motivator, I guess. <gasps> Two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and ten, and eleven, and twelve, and thirteen, and fourteen, and fifteen, and sixteen, and seventeen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two! Wow! Cherry, you're keeping up with a jock? And they're already going again. Oh my god. And then the horns is just like, nah, I, I can't do that. I, I can't do that. I'll just, I'll just work out by myself. And then get distracted by bugs. And then sit underneath tweez. I get that. Hornsby, I would much rather work out with you. But even even then. Nuh-uh. <laughs> Nuh-uh. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, yeah. They're going to talk to me. See, there we go. Well, hello there, Meline. Your home is much roomier, yes. It's nice to have even a little extra space. Which brings us to... The cost of your remodel, that will be 198,000 bells. Oh, please make your payments using the Nookstop's EBD feature, as you've done before. As always, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Yes, yes. Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Okay, nothing in this box, so we'll go and, um, and talk to him. Uh, what should I do? Ah, oh, Moline, our campsite is impressive. I'm already getting inquiries and applications from tourists who want to stay here. It won't be long until we start getting some guests. When we have a guest, a tent will go up at the campsite, so be sure to keep an eye out for that. Even though we weren't able to officially start business at the campsite yet, what we need is for visitors to be completely wowed by the wonders of life on our island. I'd appreciate anything you can do to help improve the island. Do some weeding, plant some flowers, play some outdoor decorations to enhance the scenery. Okay, uh, I will do my very best. I will do my very best, Nook. Um, you'll see, we, we will get this to uh, three stars in no time. <laughs> I was just excited briefly because we got all those extra miles, but we're still not to 8,000. Okay, so I was going to go to Nook shopping, actually. I messed up. I messed up. Okay, special goods. Floating biotope planter. Super cute. We already have one outside, but you know... Uh, it can't hurt to to order to order more, I guess. Uh, any new seasonal things? No, I will kind of hold off on the music tracks because they're quite expensive uh, for now, and then see that we just um, we do that when we we got a bit more like cash to to go freely. Okay. Um, right. So, Nook Miles. What did I get? Oh, bell ringer. What is this? How much I've spent? <gasps> 8,000, yo, 8,000. Okay, 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 okay. All right. I'll take, I'll take the pocket expansion. Okay, pocket expansion. Then I actually want to go to Hearth Island to trigger like the first conversation about the trailers and stuff. And, um, and then I think we're going to go to jump to the next day because I want to see who the campsite villager is. I'm so scared though. <laughs> okay, ultimate pocket stuffing, let's go. Please, we're down to 480 miles. <laughs> oh my god. Your order has been printed. Thank you, I need those extra, extra spaces. This totally makes sense. 
I've mastered the art of organizing. I bet I can carry a lot of stuff now. I need to teach myself that IRO um, because my, my room is a mess. Um, it's of course, all of it is like in parts that you don't see right now, but my room is a mess. And plus, <gasps> bells. There we go. We can, we can even pay the first trailer if we want to. Nice. Also, look at our pocket. <gasps> oh no, wait, I thought he was sleeping. No, he's just calming down. <laughs> Um, plus like the trip to Ikea yesterday, I mentioned it in like a previous episode. I, I moved here like about a half, like half of a year ago now, which is quite a while, but I basically moved from like my childhood home and, um, there most of the furniture in my room, I couldn't take with me cause they were like, it was built in pretty much. Um, and so I pretty much had to get everything completely new. Like I got a new bed, a new wardrobe, a new desk. Um, and so I focused on like those bigger purchases first and then took a little bit of a break pretty much And now I'm like starting to add a couple things like over the time that I live here and um, that I've lived here I got the shell that you see behind me plus like that uh, drawer wardrobe sideboard thing um, and then I just got like a new little uh, seating bench for my like in front of my bed pretty much or at the foot of my bed it's not here what did i do technically an archipelago a harvipelago wait 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 why don't you have that open <laughs> um but yeah i basically got like a little sitting bench for just some plants really just some plants um I d I'm confused now. Oh, is it also a three-star thing? Oh, you must be, you might be screaming at me right now that it's like a three-star thing. I think it is. Okay, we're gonna go, uh, we're gonna go travel to the next day. I might cut out some of the loading times, but I think we're just gonna go quickly jump to the next day and then see what that day holds for us, which is actually a campsite visitor. We already know, but I'm... I'll see you in a second. And here we are. Let's see. Isabel, tell us everything that's new. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Callan, it's 1.32 p.m. on Wednesday, July 13th, 2022. Now for today's announcements. Today we have a visitor staying at the campsite. I hope the entire island joins me in giving our guest a warm welcome. Also, the most wonderful thing happened to Callan today, the Able Sisters tailoring shop opened. The tailor shop will have all the fashion items you'd expect as well as a custom design gallery. This is a great chance for everyone to enjoy new styles and maybe start our own Callan trends. And of course, we'll be holding a special ceremony to celebrate the happy news. If you're interested in participating and have the time, please check in with Tom Nook at Resident Services. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. I'm super scared. Um, I was just, uh, just to briefly finish the thought before, um, basically my room is a mess and the entire Ikea trip where we also bought like a bunch of like new plants and all that kind of stuff didn't really help the chaos. So I could use some of those organizing skills. I'm kind of impressed that I still knew why we started talking about that topic. <laughs> Okay, it looks like I've got a couple of extra bells in my pockets. We have a visitor staying at the campsite, y'all. I... Uh... Super scared. And I didn't talk to Annabelle yesterday. No! No! Okay, it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Alright, we should probably just go ahead and before anything else happens... I don't want to go in. I do not want to go in. Okay. Do I have like a more shooketh reaction? Can I cry? Okay. Um. And I think Red is here today. Oh yeah, I see Red's um little logo. Um. And the Able Sisters, we can get like an outfit. We can try and see if we find glasses. Let's check, let's check Nook's cranny first. I'm procrastinating. Not even because I wanted to be more, not even because I wanted to be more interesting and you to stick around. What? Are they kidding me? Are they kidding me? They've got two trash cans and then two pink items. You must be joking. You must be joking. Really? 
Holy heck, that was very charming. Very charming display. Thank you so much, Nooklings. Okay, um, yeah, okay. After seeing two trash cans and two pink items, I do not have high hopes. So let's go and see who this is. And I, I'm just, I'm going to expect the worst. I'm going to expect the worst. Not the worst. <laughs> it's not the worst. <laughs> it's Phil. It's fine. Phil is fine. F fly. Okay, whatever. Um. Wait. So this one is. Oh my god. What is the what is the what is the the um, the thing called again? Not a snooty. Lazy cranky. Smug, smug. Okay, there we go. Sorry. Buongiorno. The name's Phil. Glad to see I'm the first one using this campsite. And you live on this island, don't you? I figured. Yeah, I'm pretty good at reading people. I can even tell that you're really gonna enjoy having me here. <sighs> yeah, I mean, Phil is, is not my favorite, but it could have been Coulson or Rodney, so I'm not gonna... Um, yeah, I'm not going to say anything against this. Hark, I've gotten really used to the Callan life. I don't even want to go home, and I have 788 thread count sheets on my bed there. You should live here. Wow, I'm honored. An exclusive invitation to an exclusive island for celebrities and entourages. There's just one little thing. I'd hate for it to be so exclusive that it's just me. Can you go check with, like, the VIP manager of the whole island first? Just so I know this is legit. Uh, leave that to me. Guten talk. My fate is in your hands, haha. -ha. It's weird reading out something something German with an English accent. <laughs> Guten talk. Okay. Um, alright, so I guess it's Phil. That's okay though. That is okay. Um, let's go and collect all the shells and then like start from the back we're gonna make our way to the front and uh on our way there we're also gonna go and then select an outfit are the bugs here maybe i keep looking for these maybe they're not even like july bugs maybe i should look that up and not mention it every episode because i feel like maybe some people are annoyed if that's actually the case like if you can't find these right now okay um we do have a message bottle which we'll check in just a second um, and then we should definitely go into the villager house, at least for like the recipe. Even if we don't talk to everyone today, um, we should at least check for the recipe. And this recipe is going to be by Punchy. I was walking around yesterday picking up DIY stuff and it came up with a great recipe. I could have kept it for just me, but I like sharing fun stuff. Punchy is awesome. A water pump. Great. Thank you. That's part of the first few recipes. Are you kidding me? Punchy. Please. I expected better from you. <laughs> oh my god, I've got Punchy on my uh, city island. Um, I actually record- oh, there we go. I actually recorded a video yesterday that I haven't- I haven't edited that one yet, but it should be out by the time this episode comes out, which explains kind of all the different islands and, um, and, um, kind of where we're at with them. So yeah. I see a little party hat. Okay. Hey there, welcome to Able Sisters, where we sell fashions made lovingly by Claw. Oh hey, it's the great spot finder Moline. Thanks for picking this fantastic location for us. We've decided to put down roots here in Callan and keep selling your clothes and accessories. Let me give you a quick tour of our shop. Okay, so when you first walk in, you'll find our recommended items right there front and center. We change these up every single day, you know, to keep things fresh. Then over on the left, you'll find our mannequins. They're dressed up in whatever seasonal outfits we're into. We change them up from time to time rather than daily. Still, we hope you'll be inspired. And of course, if you see something on the mannequins you'll love, you're more than welcome to buy it. Which brings us to the back wall. Here you'll find custom designs brought in by our customers. We'd love to display your designs, of course, and if you want any of these designs, they're yours for free. Speaking of custom designs, next to the wall displays, you'll find our custom designs portal. You can use that kiosk to order designs from creators all over the world and even share your own. And the last thing I want to tell you about is the fitting room. It's on the right side of the shop in the back. This is where you can go to try on anything that's available for sale that day, including all the color variations. Our display space is limited, so the fitting room is also the place to check out items we couldn't put out. Yeah, the fitting room is really great, and it's a terrific way to see how an outfit is coming together. I think that's everything. Wow, I guess I kind of... 
I guess I get kind of chatty when I'm talking about the shop. We're open every day from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. I hope I'll be seeing you in here lots. Those aren't great work hours, Mabel. You should check with your boss. Uh, sorry, can't talk. Soon, my friend. We're gonna be friends soon. That's our fitting room. Go in there to try stuff on, and if you like it, you can buy it right then and there. It's a great way to see how things actually look on you, and you can try multiple things at once, too. It's super convenient, so please feel free to use it anytime. Okay, first outfit, y'all. First outfit. Okay, we've got lacy tanks, open collar shirts, a pineapple aloha shirt. We also have a python print jacket, perfect, and a track jacket and a workout top. Box pleated skirts, floral skirts, kung fu pants, uh, and outdoor shorts. We got astro dresses and mages dresses. Uh, we do have a straw boater. Kind of cute. Kind of cute. We do have a tiny party cap, which honestly, love. Um, some headgear, and then we only have sunglasses today. Okay. You know. Uh, dotted knee-high socks, not a fan of those, and horizontal striped tights. Mm -hmm. Cowboy boots, mage's boots, shower sandals, and water sandals. Um, yeah, I'm not really a fan of like any of this stuff right now. But let's see if maybe I can put together an outfit that I don't hate. Um, pretty sure we've gotten the open collar shirt from like a balloon or something before. So let's try and work with something else. I don't like when the arms are completely exposed because I don't like that IRL either. I don't ever wear like tank tops uh, unless it's like literally 35 or 40 degrees outside Celsius. But you know. Um, I mean, I don't have to make an outfit, right? <laughs> I don't have to make an outfit. I think we're actually maybe not going to make an outfit. Um, I just want to get a party cap. Which one shall I get, though? Orange? Yellow? Green? Blue? Maybe maybe a different shirt. Hmm. Maybe not. <laughs> this one, this jacket, great. Track jacket. Aloha shirt. Hmm. It's not that's not the vibe, I think. I mean that's cute, but it's just, it's very not me. No, we're gonna keep what we got. And then go with the green. Um different shoes? Also no. Okay, I think this is gonna be it. I do want to wear my party hat. I mean, excuse me, of course I do. <laughs> wow, you look great. Thanks for your business. I'll go ahead and ship what you were wearing before directly to your storage at home. All right, and then also I'm just going to quickly interact with the kiosk here because uh, then I can. I think I can purchase something from the Nook Mile things. A world of creativity awaits via the custom designs portal. You can download custom designs from creators all over the world and even share your own designs. You can also take it on the go. Visit the Nook Stop and redeem miles for access via the custom designs app. Would you like to access the this internet kiosk? Um, briefly, yes. I don't know if like just this interaction would already be enough. So we're just going to quickly access it once. Um, not download any codes just yet. I don't have anything prepared. I mean, I have... I have some codes prepared, but not all of them. Um, that took pretty long. <laughs> uh, that took pretty long, but there we go. This is the first interaction. They're gonna, they're gonna tell us. I, th I thought they were gonna let us more, uh, let us know more things, but apparently not. Okay, very good. We've got Able Sisters with the custom designs portal. We've talked to them. We have a little tiny party cap and um, party cap. Heart hat, what was the what was it called? Something along those lines. And then let's just go and talk to uh, Nook so that we initiate the um, new bug, new bug, I think. So that we initiate the moving thing, right? Is this a new one? It is, tiger beetle, I pounced first. Okay, awesome. <laughs> Okay, um, yeah, Nook, and then I see the money tree. We should find the money spot for today. Um, 
But yeah, I'm pretty sure he would give us the plot, right? I think so. Let's see. Let's see. And then... There's a couple of dailies for us to do, which maybe we'll do, we'll do those like next um, in the next episode or something. But yeah, let's see. Ah, Maline, hello. Isabel mentioned it in today's broadcast, but today we have our first guest over at the campsite. If you have time, or even if you don't have time, make time and go check in on our guest. And if you get an opening, try talking them into moving to Callan. Um, I did it. What, really? Moline, you've done it, and so quickly. Then this means we have no time to waste. Our next course of action will be building a new home. Now, Moline, since you closed the deal with our visitor, you should be the one to pick the location for a new home. All right, leave it to me. I knew you'd agree to it. You'll need a housing kit to set aside a plot for their home, so I'll give you that now. Mm-hmm. That was the plan, yes. It's in with your belongings now, so find a good spot for a home and then come back to see me. Well, then off you go. Okay, um, I was just gonna say, let's just st stack this money together. <laughs> um, we're saving up a bit. That's good, though. That's very good. I'm actually gonna put some money in our bank. Um, oh, and get some extra miles. Awesome. Maybe would have forgotten that, you know. Um, deposit. Just around, maybe like 70,000. Yeah, we got money in the bank, y'all. And then quickly... Uh, once we're here, or now that we're here, we're gonna check the Nook, nook Shopping. Uh, Hose Reel, Mr. Flamingo... Not really. Okay. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna exit out again. Find a spot for the house. Which, again, beach, I think. I just don't know if, like, to the left or right. Um... Let's see... The back left could work. I kind of don't want... I don't want to share my private beach. <laughs> you know? We've got a private beach. We shouldn't share it. Okay, campsite is here. We got Nook's Cranny. We got Able Sisters. And then... I don't know if any of this is like a big enough space. But we're gonna, we're gonna check it out. So the housing kit too close to the water. I guess that probably won't change. Yeah. Mm okay. That doesn't seem like enough either. Um, maybe this could be... If we move further back. Oh, too close to the ledge. Okay. Okay, but that works. Alright, cool. We're gonna put him here then. Sold. Okay, good. I picked a spot for a future home to be built. I hope it works. This spot is reserved for Phil. Uh, so we are going to... Oops. We're going to go uh, go back to Nook. Talk to him. And I think that should be it, or do we need to go to Phil as well? I mean, we could. That's That works out. That works out. But I think if we talk to Nook... um. It should all be like prepared to prepare to go. Yeah, let's see. Ah, oh, Malin, hello. Did you find a place for us to build a new home? Of course. Ah, oh, fine news indeed. We don't want to keep our customer waiting, so I'll proceed with construction at supersonic speed. We want our new island friends to start their lives here as quickly as possible. After all, this has got me thinking. We can't predict when someone will want to move here, but scrambling to secure a plot only when the need arises is much to ha have. How do you pronounce the, that word? I'm gonna look that up. <laughs> Ahem, a way of doing business. Ah, uh, yes, of course. As part of improving infrastructure, we'll set aside plots in advance and put them up for sale. I'll have to charge a small processing fee, but if we get a buyer who moves in, I'll give you miles as a reward. I do hope I can count on your help again. Okay, actually, um, that is a good point because we're, we're just gonna do that. We're just gonna go get... Um, Wait, we got five villagers, campsite six, so we need to sell two plots. Um, we're gonna also go ahead and autofill them, because that's like the, the quickest thing. It costs 10,000 bells, which we'll do. Um, I'll just collect the fee, that will be 10,000 bells, please. And um, yeah, I'll just hand over the housing kit you'll need. Use it to claim a plot for a new house, Malin. Just use the kit when you find a good location. 
Can I get the second one right now? Probably not, right? Let's chat. There are a number of things we can discuss. Sell some land. Okay, yeah, so he is... For bookkeeping reasons that I'm sure you'd find tedious, I can only give you one of these at a time. Yeah, so there's no real... <laughs> there's no real reason. Okay, so, um, once again, I will say goodbye to you from uh, the resident services. This time, though, with a little party hat. And um, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next episode, which will be um, placing the housing plots and then probably also filling, like auto filling them already, um, going to reds, a couple of dailies, all that kind of stuff. Uh, and I hope you'll have an awesome time until that happens and I'll see you again. Bye bye.